So hi everyone, welcome back to Data Science in a Pocket and the Quen team has released a new image editing model that is Quen Image Edit 2509. It is an upgrade over Quen Image Edit, the previous version released in August and now it supports multiple image editing. Yes, you heard it right. You can now merge images, do them, make them do any stuff and what not. Now I think the days of Google Nano Banana are numbered and this is a crazy competition we can all see. So let's get started. First of all, we're trying out the model for free on Quen Chat, and let's see how it performs. So I'll be taking up a few images from my system. So these are two images that I've uploaded. Now let me give it a prompt. A guy playing with the ball. So let's see what it generates as mentioned it has also improved on character consistency so i wish to see that what features it is able to keep from the guy that i have uploaded and how much time does it take the model is completely open sourced also so i think you can try out the model if you have enough hardware we'll be showing you the codes too and the details about the model as well but first let's try out the model for free And as you can see, it's okay. -ish. The ball is preserved, that's for sure. The guy's face has changed a bit. No, I think it's it's okay. I think I'll take this up. Now let's choose out another image. So one is a beloved Batman, and again the same guy. Make the two guys fight with each other on top of a terrace. It's raining and they are fighting for life. So let's see this one. I think even if you look at the inference time, it was not that huge. So a win-win situation for all. And I think it, it looks better than Google Nano Banana to be honest, because lately the results on Nano Banana are not great, very honestly. There are other features that they have introduced in the new model too, but the major highlight is the multi-image editing that we are demonstrating right now. With two images, we'll try out a third image as well. And then we'll jump on to the details of the model too. Okay. This is fine. This is fine. I would still take this up. Not that bad. Not great, but not that bad too. Now let's start something else. Now we will try out three images. All three of them are playing in a park. It's a sunny day. So we will have now merging three images together. I think it, it supports still three images. So that would be funny to see what output we get. One is a dog, other is a girl and the third one is a Batman. It would be quite some excitement. I think it has also improved on text writing too as mentioned. So we can try out that too. Now I think as you can see, no one is coming close to the Quen team. They have released a number of models yesterday, be it Omni, be it the TTS model, and now even the image editing update too. So I think in terms of open source, I think Quen team is leading the charts by a huge margin now. DeepSeek was a leader at the point, but now the Quen team has taken over in terms of all the domains, it's not just the text, but even image generation as well. And I think they are landing in the audio arena as well. This is nice. This is nice. This is very good. What an edit, I would say. I will give it a 10 on 10. So we will now attempt last image edit and then we'll jump on to details of the model. The guy playing with the ball on fire, the title is Batfire. So let's test out the 
text writing capabilities of the model too and then we'll jump on to the details of the model as you can see i'm testing out the model on quen chat which is free to use for everyone you just need to create an account even the model is available for free on hugging face spaces you can try that out too and if you have enough gpu you can run the model locally too it's at the way it's are open source see when such a technology like this image editing video editing becomes open source for everyone this is a little risky also but the latest tech is available for all that fire this looks nice i think i would still take it up because the prompt was not that complete hence I can't complain on the quality, but I will still take it up given the prompt. Great model to be honest. It is able to merge things out quite well and adding text also is nice. So I'll surely give it a 8 or 9 on 10. So Quen image edit 2509. Goodbye Google Nano Banana for sure. I'll leave forward in AI image editing. The model is open source. So there is just no comparison in Nano Banana. Talking about the introduction. Monthly iterations of image editing model, September release the leap forward because in August they released the first version that was also good and it is just more than surface level tweaks. These are major upgrades that they have given. Multi image editing as mentioned, handles up to three inputs combined to single coherent edit, merge portraits, place people in new background, blend products and what not. Consistency improvement, I think better at preserving identity that's for sure. Restored old photos, apply filters, accurate text replacement with font, color, and control. Control net. I think native support, not just a hack. I think feed structural guide, depth maps, edge maps, key point poses, keep specific poses or follow drawn outline. So I think they have introduced control net in their model, which is helping them out a lot, as you can see on the right hand side. Comparing the two versions that was released in August versus September, August just supported single image, now it supports multiple images. Unreliable identity consistency, yeah. but now I think stronger consistency can be seen, better editing can be seen, and full native control net support is there now. What it can do? Merge multiple inputs, generate portraits, Change pose with control net, create memes, restore old images and what not. I think marketing is going to be booming up now. Why it matters? I think from playground to practical tool now. Build scenes rather than just tweak pictures. Trustworthy for identity sensitive edits and precision for professional workflows too. Final thoughts? Yeah, turning point for Quinn. For sure, the model is very strong. It's not just an update and supports actual creative vibe lens completely open source so available for all so what are you waiting for you should try out the model asap so before we wrap this up here is the hugging face page for the model quen image edit 2509 and they have mentioned all the improvement that they have gotten and here is the code that you can use first you need to update diffusers and then this is the pipeline is quite easy as you can see and you can run the pipeline from hugging face page so with this, it's a wrap. I hope you try out Quen Image Edit 2509. Looks to be bonkers. And brace yourself for the AI coming in. Thank you so much.